Hey you guys, what's up? We are back in Rage 2 for DLC number 2. It's called Terror Mania. I'm supposed to be able to run out of town and it activates. Ah! How glad you accept the task given to you. Um, what? Mango needs assistance. Mango? The Necro Disc. Hand it to me. Stolen by them. A record with unspeakable power. Too powerful. Even for you. We must retrieve it. Yeah, uh, I'm sort of busy right now and don't know if... Uh... Ah, yes. I will see you soon, as you will see me at the cabin. <sighs> okay. The cabin, huh? Mission started. Terra Mania. Investigate the cabin. So, here's what we got in this, you guys. A new weapon. And it's a sword. It's a sword. So we gotta go over here. Terra Mania. Now, I'm interested to see if this is going to be... If this is gonna be like a new region. But it... From the videos and the pictures I saw, it looked, it looked pretty cool. Like, the sword. It's like a Skyrim sword, you know? Magical powers and all that fun stuff. Alright, let's go to this cabin. Was it at this way? Okay. This is not the easiest way to get across. You got to take the bridge. Taking the bridge. So I just, I just now, just before I did this one, I just finished the DLC number one. I had a short, twenty-minute video or something about it. <clears throat> it was cool. It was cool. I liked uh, having some more. You know, I figured this game was over for me. I actually, to be honest with you, kind of totally forgot about the game. And, you know, in a way, these roadmap releases are kind of whack. But in a way, they're good. I just don't like for them to wait too long, right? Because, like, if I played the, I played 36 hours of this game. There's an arc right there. I played 36 hours of this game. And, you know, at that point, the, re the repetitiveness was getting to me a bit. So I was done with it. But getting a new uh, DLC was cool. But it's like I said, you kind of lose sight of... Is it right here in this area? Oh, it's farther still. Investing me... Ooh, look at this cabin. Creepy looking cabin. All right. All right. You're about to start Terramania DLC near the cabin will teleport to alt... Oh, alternative world enemies. Will be a bigger challenge you face so far? Come prepared. Yeah, I'm gonna continue. Get me out of my, my thingy here. All right. I wanted to shoot that balloon, but now it's too far back there. Where's your door? Oh, look at this. This is where you're supposed to walk up. Okay. Who's this guy? Oh, you. You're here. Zombies. They what they do not grasp. Look, look. The Necro Disc! They must not spin it incorrectly, for then unspeakable things may happen. Get out of my way. I've got a better idea. Let's play it backwards. Uh oh. Not backwards! It's gonna take us to an alternate zombie reality. No! no. We were too late! The shift is over! What's happening? No, 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 I'm getting sucked in. I knew it. Never trust a zombie. They'll suck you in. All right, this should be pretty cool. It's going to be zombies in Rage 2, huh? I mean, the other fools were kind of whack too, so. Uh, okay. What happened? The record. The necro disc. It was shattered. And it took you with it. Uh -oh. I've been... Pick up the sword. Ooh, they're not waiting too long to give us the new sword of... Gimme! Cool. Magical sword. Whoa. <laughs> uh, hi there. What are the odds of you being a friendly fella? <laughs> Zombie skeleton? Yeah. Oh, nice. 
Any special, what's the special ability with the sword? Now, to upgrade the sword, I read, you have to do these bone towers. And that's the only Welcome way to upgrade the sword. To the Deadlands. Okay. You wanna tell me what's going on here? The Necro Disc. The sacred artifact that was played rearwards now lies in shards. The different pieces found in bone towers. As it broke, a rift was created. A portal to another dimension. Uh, meaning? It must be repaired and brought home to its shrine. If not, the armies of bone will seek out your reality and wreak havoc upon it. So, find the record shards, bring them together, and put them back in the record player to stop the skeletons? Uh, yes. <laughs> uh, yes. Enter a bone tower. All right, so we've got one, two, three, four, five. Looks like five bone towers. Oh, look how small it is. Okay. So, I imagine this area is going to open up, but we've got these bone towers to do. Enter a bone tower. All right, let's do um, let's do this one first. Oh, look at that! Oh, it's cool looking. So they picked the region that is the swamps. You know, last DLC I got that new Feltrite laser beam with Doom, and I used it a lot. So I think I'll try and use this sword a fair bit. I can't wait to see what the upgrades for it are. I think I saw them throwing the sword. Okay, okay. Now, I saw a chest up here. How the heck do you get up to that? Like that, wow. That was shockingly, surprisingly that I made it. All right, I may have to go with some regular weapons because the sword right now, it's... You really throwing yourself into the action. I like the look of this place. Ah, a bone tower. You are sure to find a necro disc shard within. Okay, so this is a level 10. This is max level. So, I have all my other weapons. Why is it called INF? Sword of Transitus. A mysterious blade found in the Deadlands. According to Mango, it is an old relic of bygone time can be a crucial tool in stopping skeleton armies, and it looks very badass. True. Can I throw it or anything? Oh, what was that? I don't know what that move was. Oh, wow. I was just sitting there trying things with my sword. I almost died. Okay, need some health infusion. All right, let, I want to test see how the skeletons like the Feltrite launcher. They don't do... Oh, shield! They don't like it, do they? Oh, eat it, eat it. Oh, shoot. Oh, my God, that's a big dude. That's a big dude. Oh, shoot. Level 10. Level 10. All right. All right. All right. I get it. I get it. I'll be over here. Somebody's shooting some bad things at me. I need some range. I need some range. Show your face. Wow, that dude's tough as nails. All right, all right. We got a challenge on our hands. That dude's... That guy right there to rocket launcher. Saw it in his hand. Is that that big dude that... Can't even get to the tower, man. Guy's got a shield. Not a handle, you shield fools! Rocket launcher guy. That guy 
guy's hitting grenades at me with a baseball bat. So I gotta go there to launch up, apparently. Woo! Alright, bone tower it is. So we gotta find a shard up in this place. Juicy. One Enter the bone tower. Dimensional portal express ticket, please. So, do you teleport in and it becomes another battle area? Because there's obviously ah, oh. the twilight of the Deadlands. How beautiful it is! Oh yeah, very pleasant. Just because I am an ethereal being does not mean I do not pick up on sarcasm. Okay. Find the necro dish shot. And learn some manners. The heck is that noise? These are armored guys, they're definitely taking longer to that dude's the baseball bat grenade launcher guy. Baseball bat. Oh, shoot. Oh, it's the guardian. The guardian. All right. You know what? Maybe the guardian wants some shotgun action. Oh, I missed my lunch. Booyah! He... Oh, he survived. He just lost his shield. Right, I gotta go get Mr. Bone Guardian over there. See ya! There's the big boy right there. He tried to hit me with his baseball bat. Shotgun for days. Is that guy wearing a trash can lid on his head? I wonder if these are never-ending waves until you kill the guardian. It, it almost... It almost feels that way. I'm fine with it. I'm not killing skeletal, skeletal zombies. stuff that didn't work so good that didn't work so good Overdrive engage. oh he's almost dead each shotgun oh look at that belt right all right tasty and delicious be fully uh, reloaded in our... Is that another Guardian? No, that's just a shield. The shield guys are pretty big. Shield dudes are big. Jeez. Alright, 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 
I get it, I get it, they're pissed. Assault rifle. I gotta, re I gotta figure out where this thing is to retrieve it. I thought I saw like a, a main place. Son. All right, so I gotta go back. That's the guardian. It's marking the guardian. These guys, I think these are non-stop dudes. So we'll go kill that guardian, and then we'll look for look for this shard. Trying to get up here. boss like that with this gun you have a tendency to run out of ammo because you're not killing him to recharge to get all his felt right drop and recharge wow rocket launcher all right mr guardian eat it eat it supposed to go up there you think that's just gonna launch us back to here in the center where is it where's the shard these guys are just respawning for days My laser. What about down here? In the area we have not been. Ammo. Ooh. Action unlimited right here. Guardian. This is our third guardian. And it says to retrieve the shard, but it's not saying where it's at. Wonder if I have to kill these guys with the sword. Maybe if I kill the guardian with the sword. I don't think that's gonna be that easy. That needs the rocket launcher guy right there. Non-stop refill of Feltrite for health and for ammo. Rage mode engaged. This is refill 
purple juice right here. Jeez Louise, dude, it's non-stop. Where can I find this thing at? Wait, there's a door here. There's a door here. I bet you have to kill so many guardians, right? Three of four, there we go. I see, okay, we have to kill four guardians. And then I bet you this door opens. All right, now at least I know that I'm not missing something. Whoop. Bring on your guardian. Bring on the guardians. Keep moving around till he respawns. Oh yeah. Bring on a guardian, man. That's double trouble right there. Show me your face. You know what? I'm going to use the BFG 9000 on him. Oh! What happened? BFG 9000? So it said also that you upgrade your sword via the bone tower. So we'll see if that's something. So that's cool. It's like a excellent, excellent. You truly are worthy of interdimensional travel, a walker between worlds, if you will. Okay. More shards await us. We must find another bone tower. All right. Obviously. Enter new dash lunge. Okay, using your nano trite dash ability within proximity of enemy will make you lunge towards said enemy with the sword. Okay. Control tap. Dash lunge. All right. Is that it? What is my what is my dash? Hey, focus, shatter, slam, barrier, vortex, and rush. Oh, that? Maybe it's just to tap control. All right, where's the next closest? Well, I just need to find an enemy to test this out. I don't need to show you guys every bone tower. But it seems like that maybe that's the DLC is just you got to do these bone towers. Now, I was told that once you get to this point, you can go you can go in and out of here. I think maybe. And then once you finish all the bone towers, you can go back through and do them again. 700 900 700 535. I guess we have to hoof it to them. I don't have any vehicles in here, right? I don't have any vehicles. I just want to see a, an enemy so I can test out this new sword thingy. That's going to be cool, though. It's like when you... Do I have to take the roads to it? I'm going the wrong way. I got to go around this. Apparently, that dash right there is... Here we go. You going to appear? Ooh. Nope. Hear him. This was always one of those weird areas, too, to get around, and there's the house. 
There's a bone tower right there. I can see it. Oh, that's the move. Okay. That's our first one, too. That's cool. Alright, I can see that tower. I saw another tower there. That's a pretty good move, just the, the quick dash and it bashes him with the sword. Actually helps to close the distance. in the midst of it with the with the sword though you gotta you gotta Assault rifle. Oops. Just clicked off the screen. My bad. Oh, it's way up there. Look at that. You have to jump here. Jump here. Get this. Oh, I almost went too far. This. Ouch. I made this one kind of a little bit more difficult to get to. Unless I just run through this to get over there. This is just like, this isn't even a tower. This isn't the tower area. This is just a collect the storage container area. It's it's cool. It's kind of like the uh, like the offshoots on, in other games. You know, it's like... Um, that eye's on a phone tower. Like a blood dragon was for Far Cry, you know? It's it's this weird alternate, the different music, the different look to the game. I always said I thought that, that was that was a viable thing. Like if you've got yourself a good base game, all you gotta do is change some uh change some of the textures and stuff, change what the what the enemies look like. There's the bone tower. All right, so you just you just go go around to the top of the tower. Oh shoot! I almost missed that jump. What? Cool. There it is, right there. Should we do one more? We'll do, we'll just do, we'll I'll do one more. Okay. And I think that'll right. be good. Here we go. You get the idea. There's probably no way to, oops, no way to um, spawn the guardians in faster. Slay awesome. skeletons ah, to awaken the guardians. All right, so you have to kill. me back. Like wisps of smoke, the memories appear and dissipate. All right, so the more skeletons. Right. The necro discharge must be found. So look at this is putting us in like another region of the uh, of the thing. So you gotta s kill skeletons to awaken the guys. So you just gotta kill. That's the key. All right, skeletons. Time is. I just clicked off the screen again. I don't know why it does that. Okay. 
Reload Believer. I guess those things are probably around to kill skeletons, but we got some rocket launcher guys up there. Oh shoot, that's a big dude. Dude, that'll kill that rocket launcher guy that's annoying me. Oh, there's a guardian in. All right, so it's, I guess the key would be to kill the guardians as fast as you can. Oh shoot, he's good. He's good. Dude, he is aggressive. That didn't help. That didn't help. All right. One down. These rocket launcher guys are something to contend with, I'll tell you that. Kill more skellies. Assault rifle. Oh shoot. Must kill skellies. Dang it. I don't know why he keeps doing that. It's like your mouse works its way to the corner of your screen. And I have to record this on desktop capture, not game capture, because it seems like all Bethesda type games lately have been doing that. Something to do with, uh, I forget what they call it. Alright, let me go kill this guy. I only have one BFG left? That didn't work. That didn't work. BFG takes a while to, uh... Guardian's dead. BFG takes a bit of time to ramp up. Apparently, I've used my BFG ammo and it doesn't... You don't find it that often. That was two Guardians, we need two more. Rocket launcher guys are annoying. That dude up there. Found you. Must kill skeletons to awaken guardians. around because you can actually refill your stuff with them. Eat it, Guardian, eat it! Alright. Ooh, three or four. Okay. I just want to show you guys whatever the next upgrade we get with the sword is. I tell you, fighting these guys with the sword right now would not be good. At least with this, I can kind of keep my distance a little bit as I say that. Beat that son. Armor dude. Trash can lid wearing dudes. Guardians up. 
Oh shoot, it's a big one. Wondering when something like you would show up. It's a big one. Dang rocket launcher guys, you see the rocket stuff everywhere. He's back up there again, huh? Barely hit him. Oh shoot, that's not hitting him. Hey, give me a. Where's that rocket launcher thingy that I have? Not grab dart. Smart rocket launcher. Try that. Ow! Oh, I hit the dudes in front of me. Target! Why is it not targeting me? Jeez, please, dude. I'm getting killed. Woo! Alright, alright. So this is not easy. So when he's down, is there a, a time to damage him or what? Some health juice from these guys. So he's down. It's no joke. The bigger dude is mean, rude, rude, and double tattooed. Let me build my health back up. That was good. The zone grenade blew those dudes up. Grenades seem to work on him. He's, is he throwing? He's throwing guys at me. Good. Beat it, son! Yes. Woohoo! Alright, the shard's up there. Here we go. A little ladder time. Wow, that big dude. The grenades just destroyed his face, though. Like they were. Any grenades here? The grenades are really good. Now let's see what it gives us for our sword now. Rage 2. Terror Mania. Support items can be crafted in the crafting component. You fight well. But any skeleton invasion is yet never present threat. More shards await. Rest not. All right. Let you deflect enemy fire with the sword. Blocks? Really? Oh my gosh. That! See, now that could make it super useful. That could make it really useful, because those... I don't know if you could block rocket launchers. So three more towers... Once you get your sword, I'm just curious if that's going to be it. Now, maybe, maybe I'll finish these other towers with the stream. But let's see how this block works. Hey, you fools. Hey, 
it doesn't like deflect it back to them like it doesn't make it like uh come on shoot son definitely is good at blocking but oh not too shabby all right, you guys, that's going to do it. So this was Rage 2, Terror Mania. This is DLC number two for the game. If you guys like swords and zombie skeletons, check it out.